For the last two episodes of Home But Not Alone, we will digitally travel to Hungary, where we will meet two extraordinary people. Today, we're making a short trip to Budapest, as we'll be talking to the owner of Sonic Lab Manufacturing, Mr. Gabor Hubert. We're going to learn how the contract manufacturing is developing in that market and what are the most important factors to be as successful as that company is. Hello, Gabor. How are you, sir? Hi, Akrius. I am very well, thank you. We are a little bit busy because it seems everyone wants to have uh, assembled PCB boards under the Christmas tree, but otherwise we are fine. Thank you. And yourself? Glad to hear this. Yeah, pretty good, pretty good, pretty good. Just uh, waiting for the Christmas as well and a lot of work, as you mentioned. So thank you very much for, for sharing the, this time with us. I appreciate it. Um, Gabor, you. would you mind telling us a bit about Sonic Lab Manufacturing story so far? And what have you been able to accomplish? Sure. When we started in 2013, we offered the design and manufacturing services. The manufacturing was optional, but uh, later we just received more and more requests for prototype manufacturing and mm -hmm. as well as more series production. That, but that time we only had a very, very tiny SMT machine that we could use for producing prototypes only. So after we received those requests, we started to introduce new machines to, to serve those, those requests. Actually, this year we, we assembled 744 different batches. So, and, and every, so actually we, we assemble, assemble three boards on every work, week, work day. So the average batch size at the moment is 44 pieces. So that means this year we assembled more than 33,000 boards. Wow, that's a, that's a pretty nice number. And what do you think makes you so successful in the market? Actually, I think one of our most important thing is that we have an online shop for PCB assembly. Mm -hmm. And this is, this is very unique on, in the market in, in Hungary and, and in Europe. Uh, our customers can have a quotation instantly by entering the, the numbers, some numbers about the PCB assembly and as well as the bare PCB. So our customers can have an instant quote on our, our website. Um, after that, the code is accepted. The customers can send us the uh, bill of materials, and we mm -hmm. and we have to uh, analyze this bill of material within a few hours. We do everything we can to analyze the bill of materials on the same day. Actually, we offer. PCB assembly is as fast as in five working days, and that five working days includes the production of the bare PCB, the procurement of the goods, the assembly, as well as the optical inspection. Of course, the customer can choose between different timing options, different mm -hmm. based on, on the urgency of, of this project, and of course, the, the price changes accordingly. Uh, our, our services are still affordable because we do a lot of uh, optimizations uh, during the production. So um, even with very complex and challenging boards, we can, we can uh, uh, offer a great price for the assembly as well as for the components. So, yeah, yeah. I was I was always very impressed when I visited your location on the creative approach you had for each individual customer, also in terms of the testing. I know I was overwhelmed with that, but I'm really happy that you mentioned automation and the approach uh, with you know fast delivery. So how crucial was automation and actually the API usage to your growth? Yeah, actually the component cost calculation for the board, mm -hmm. the semi-automatic process. Uh, in our company because we cannot automate everything because the customers sometimes make uh, inaccurate, enter inaccurate uh, 
part number or something like that. Mm-hmm. Something like that. So on average, a board, a batch contains 86 different components. And because as we produce three different batches on the same single day, we have to analyze 250 components bomb line each day. Without automation, it would be a very, very hard work. So by using DCKey's API, we can automatically gather the inventory and price information for for every component. But it, it's about more than just having the price and the and the inventory, because from DigiKey we can also download the component parameters. So actually we can we can compare the data we acquired from DigiKey, for example, the voltage of a capacitor mm-hmm. with the one the customer entered in, in, in his specified in his form. So we can warn the customer if we discover any issue with the, with the bombs, bomb lines. So uh, actually, I think this is one of the one of the most important factors we, we offer to our customer. Yeah, no, and I fully agree. And you know, thank you very much for for mentioning our API as well here, and that you are also yeah. going beyond the price and availability to the details of the component and far more, which is very crucial to the business, as you said, especially in you know in this fast paced uh, scenario that we're living today. And I'm happy that a lot of the companies. Because of that situation that actually happened on the market, stepped into investing into automation a little bit further. You guys were also ahead uh, a few steps earlier, and you did it uh, quite nicely. So thank you very much, and I and I fully agree that this is probably the the most crucial part on your growth and the creativity, which always blows my mind. So I'm super happy. Okay, Gabor. Yeah. So what what is the future for Sonic Lab Manufacturing, and what are you aiming to? Yes. Yeah. Actually, we have a lot of work to do. For example, we need to automate the component ordering as well. At the moment, mm-hmm. we are just exporting a file from our system and that we can, we can upload to DigiKey's website. But uh, I know it's possible with the API to, to uh, fully automate the ordering process as well. Sure. Because as we, as we receive our orders within two, in two business days from DigiKey, we can even make our services faster. And also, we are getting more and more uh, larger requests, I mean, for larger uh, batches, in a few hundred or a few thousand pieces. So mm-hmm. what we are going to do is that we will introduce uh, new machines, fully automated production lines uh, to serve those customer requests uh, as well in the same quality and same timing uh, as we just did with the prototypes and, and monitoring. Okay. No, that, that makes that makes perfect sense. So not only you, you're going to utilize already the basis of the automation that you have going beyond price and availability and the components, but you're go, going further to these ordering API. Yeah, so the automation is the key in that case. And also when you said five days from where the customer orders till the delivery, I mean, the product is, is finalized. This is amazing. And, you know, I'm super excited to hear that you even want to go faster. So Fantastic work, fantastic work. Anything, anything else to add, Gabor, from your side, or should we, should we call it a day then? Uh, actually, I think that that's all for, for my, my side. If, if you have any questions, no, I think I think it was amazing, and thank you very much. I see that you have a pretty busy line going behind you, so I'm super thankful yeah. for the time you gave us and for the, you know. Uh, uh, telling about the Sonic Sonic Lab manufacturing, the story, and you know how are you doing the things that you're doing. So thank you very much for spending the time and and all the best, and hopefully see you in person anytime soon, sir. Thank you for your call, and and and, and I hope you see see, here, see you here very soon. Thank you, Gabor. Thank, thank, you. thank you. Take care. Bye bye. Bye bye.